in order to create a bulb specification we have to create a table and then we have to add its contents its contents will include content instructional time number of items the level of behavior item format and number of placement and boom's taxonomy of thinking which is remembering understanding applying analyzing evaluating and creating so we have finished writing the table it will look like this so for the first step you have to determine the coverage for your exam so the first thing in creating a table of specification is to make sure that the coverage of your exam is something that you have certainly discussed in your class and listed below is the total of your table and so after determining the test objectives for each topic we must now determine the duration for each content area after that we have to determine the test types for each objective and now we have created a table of specification that is mainly rotated on Bloom's taxonomy of thinking and now it's time to determine the test types that will accomplish your testing objectives for example knowledge questions can be obtained by multiple choice tests or matching type exams and then lastly we have to publish our table of specifications so we have remembering understanding analyzing applying evaluating and creating so we have to get the totals to 30 and so the percentage we have to divide the instructional times to the overall minutes of the exam and then multiply it by 100 so example 20 minutes divided by 16 multiplied by 100 is 30 percent and so on so in the percentage we have to get a whole number in the percentage like 17 percent the total calculation is 16.6 percent so we have to round this up to get the 17 percent and if you add the whole percentage it will result in showing us 100 percent and so that is how you create a three-way table of specification i hope you learned something today that is all for my video and thank you for watching